Hi guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today I have been playing around a little bit again with my white balance in the camera because I just thought that all of my previous videos looked so cool toned, like even more cool toned than in reality. And I guess this is a little bit more warm toned than in reality, but I feel like I can't find the best setting, you know? At least it doesn't work every day with the same setting. That's what I'm finding out. So I hope this is a little bit better than before. Let's see. <laughs> but today we're going to do the update for Throwback 30, a project in which we have, you know, bundled together 30 different projects from the Fantastic Ladies group on Facebook. If this is something you want to join, just head over to that Facebook group. It's very welcoming and uh, it's a fun group. You can find a lot of a lot of projects there. So this project, like I said, consists of 30 projects and you have like one or two prompts from each and every one of those projects. This is going to be, like I said, a very short update and that's because I haven't worked on too many products, but we have great progress on those products. So let's dive into it and start with this big one. This is from Batiste. It's their dry shampoo and I have used it up. I only had to use it twice more since the last update for a total of 15 uses to actually use it up. And this is my go-to. I will probably, like, I'm 99% sure I will buy it again. It's phenomenal. I love it. So that one is an empty. Let's move on. I actually have no, where did I put it? Didn't bring it here. I have another dry shampoo, but I realized that that was a silver shampoo. I've used that one three additional times for a total of 10 uses. Like, since you can't see the progress, these are not see-through, you can't see any progress, but I had one uh, from Leanne. Is that the name? I have to see if I actually have. Leon's. Leon's. The Leon's brand. Anyway, that dry shampoo I used three additional times for a total of 10 uses and I really don't like it. It's a silver shampoo. I didn't realize that it was for maybe colored hair or like very warm toned hair that you wanted to have cooler or something. My hair looks very warm on the screen often, but it's, it's cool toned. In, in reality. So when I use that, I only get like a grayish, bluish hair. So I really have to work it in a lot. And it's, it's just, you know, it's a hassle. I don't really want to do it. So I just want to use that one up and never have it in my collection again. So that is my, that is my goal. I think I have up to five uses left on it or something like that. The next thing I have used up, and that is from The Rituals, this is their shower foam. And I like the formula, but I don't care for the scent. It's sacred wood and lavender, but you can really, really smell the lavender and it's just overwhelming. And uh, I just wanted it out and I'm glad it's gone. I've used it 12 additional times since the last update for a total of 23 times. Now the next thing is the most exciting thing, and that is an eyeshadow single from Essence. And as you can see, it's empty, it's gone. This is my first eyeshadow single that I've ever used up. It was a beige tone, yes. It was easy to use, yes. But you know, you need those easy wins sometimes. And uh, it was a pretty big, uh, big thing. I think it was... I don't know how big it was. I don't remember. I think it might have been like two to three grams, which is not the biggest single you can find. Absolutely not. And it wasn't the hardest shade to use, but it's harder to use up a single than an eyeshadow within a palette. They're usually around 0.5 to 1.5 grams each. And you know, this is kind of double that amount. So it's, it's very nice to have this out. Also, I get to actually throw packaging out, so I have less in my collection. Using something up within a palette is fun, but getting a whole item out, that's more fun. <laughs> so I am very, very happy with that progress. I've used that 28 additional times. I used it to set my eyeshadow base. I used it to cover zits sometimes. I used it to kind of clean up edges and it was just a phenomenal product. I wouldn't mind having another one of these or you know something like it because I always use a shade like that. So if it doesn't come in uh, in a palette or if I have used it up, this is a great product to have. I used that one an additional 18 times 
for a total of 73 times to use it up. I don't think I had used it before. So that was kind of the total number for this whole thing from start to finish, which is nice to know. The upcoming three things I just have some usage on. Let's start with this liquid blush. You can already see um, where I'm at. I have made very little progress on this, even if I've used this 15 additional times. 15 times. So I've used this 54 times in total. I don't know where we started though, but I mean, if this is 15 uses, then I have a long way to go on this one. I thought maybe I could finish this by the end of this project, but I am really not sure anymore. I'm going to try though. Um, I don't love this shade. Let's, uh, let's show it to you. Like right now, I don't love it. It's a little bit too, I don't know peachy or something I I don't know I want to have more of a pinky tone than a peachy tone right now I don't know I'm under painting with this so it doesn't matter too too much but I would love to play around with my other liquid uh, liquid blushes because I just haven't and I think I have I don't know five seven of them and this is the only one I use and I think it's the only one I have used I think I've tried two of my others like once each and I would love to play around with those more but I'm just determined to use this whenever I use a liquid blush it's it's this one so yeah I don't foresee myself using the other ones soon um it's not a bad shade in itself but right now I'm just not into the color the next thing I've only used twice for a total of 11 times in this project. I had used it a lot before. Uh, I really want it out and we haven't talked about this in a long time. Right now we're down to here and uh, we don't have a lot left. So I feel like I should be able to get this out until the next update in one or two months. I think this should be my focus exfoliant for my face for a while. This as you can see is from Avant and I I love this product like in itself it's a good scrub it's not like too harsh but it's not too gentle either it does feel like it does something and um, yeah I really like it but Avant as we probably know is a ridiculously expensive brand so I wouldn't buy it full price but I'm, I'm happy to have it right now and the last thing we're going to talk about is this incredible Le Coeur Lip Tint and uh, I love this more and more for every day. So I can see through the packaging and it's going upwards. It's one of those that you, you know, you can twist up, but you can't twist it back. So I'm not going to show you that way. I'm not going to mark it for you right now, but we're like, where? Um, we're up to here and that is like 30 uses, but I don't want to mark it yet because I want to know how far 50 uses will take me so that I know you know, realistically, if I can finish it within a year or within a few months, you know. I have used this 22 more times for a total of 32. What can I say? It's very, very messy. So you can see that I actually happen to take a lot more. Um, but this is, you know, when I sheer it out a bit. And it's like a lip gloss. And I love it. It looks very natural on the lips. I can use it with or without any other makeup, it feels good. And um, yeah, I really enjoy this. 22 times, that is a lot. So we don't have too many times extra because my goal was 50 uses on this one. I have another lipstick in this project that I want to use 50 times as well. And I've only used that one 21 times in total. So I just feel like I need to get going, get this one out and then I can use the other one. That one is a pH lipstick from Essence and it makes my lips very very pink like barbie pink <laughs> so i definitely enjoy this one more and um, i'm happy it's not out of this project yet so i can still use it and that is it for today i hope you enjoyed this update and that i'll see you in the next one have a great evening bye